Um, how many of you are using Luster? I'm just curious. Wow. Wow. Okay. And, and maybe if we could go around, why? why? Why is Luster important to what you're doing? I think the biggest reason initially is just uh, large storage and having a single uh, file system. Uh, people are really used to using POSIX type things and, and it's a great solution. I also work historically with a lot of engineering clients. And they go and run on larger national systems and so it's nice to have uh, a, a, the same file system across. They're already used to it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, for us, uh, the Lustre setup is because the aggregated bandwidth you get with uh, all the different OSTs um, and we just need that kind of access to read writes at that, at that rate. Not, not an incredible, you know, like we don't need um, 40 or 50 gigabytes per second. Like in the 10 range is probably what the system is normally um, runs at. So. And then Luster's able to deliver that without putting yeah. the sweat, I would imagine. Yeah. yeah. It, it's no. not, um, and now that, now that we're also, I would say, now that we're in Luster, like, you know, like 2.0, it's much more stable and much, you know, easier for us. And no more late nights, we hope, you know, for, we used to have 1.6 and... If, you know, if a failover happened from one OSS to the other and you tried to re revive it, and at that time we also didn't have a redundant MDS, you would almost inevitably, like, you know, roulette will of, will the MDS kernel panic, you know, right. so, right. so that's, that's the kind of the, the joy of being past that in some newer technology. Thank you, Scott. Um, we used uh, Luster initially. Um, for uh, the main reason was uh, this performance requirement for uh, our large uh, numerical weather prediction uh, yeah. computer S4. And then once we had gotten into it, um, we, we actually uh, benchmarked uh, Gluster with a G also for, for that same project. And uh, we couldn't get the RDMA performance out of it that we needed. So we do have a large version of both. But as we've worked more with Luster, uh, it's, uh, we're using it for, for things that don't have as high performance needs because the model works well. And it, it, it is stable. We've had good experience with it. And so, uh, and the ability to uh, export it to patchless Linux clients of any type is what's really begun to make it more popular rapidly. So mm -hmm. that's what. Yeah, down to Eric. We're, we're using Luster uh, mainly for performance. That was our initial. And then also because it's open source uh, yeah. so that we don't have complicated license fees that was important. 